this as an internally bandaged 3x3. Now you may be wondering, how, what, what, what does that mean? Or how does that affect how the puzzle turns? Because this puzzle looks it, it looks the same as a regular 3x3 other than the, the stickers. Um, and uh, uh, I, 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 I guess I can show you, you can see that it turns like a regular 3x3 would. Then you can turn here. Um, but sometimes, when you make a turn, the turn is blocked. You can see I can't make that turn, I can't make that turn, I can't make that turn, and I can't make that turn. So there, there's, there is uh, some method to the, the madness of this cube. Um, <clears throat> it's not like the, the nightmare 2x2, two two, which is a 2x2 a two two where uh, it's, you, you can't see what's bandaged in it, so you have no idea when you can make a turn and when you can't make a turn. Uh, it's a little bit simpler than that. And uh, you may sort of be noticing what uh, what it is, uh, or wh wh what type of moves this cube can make. Because if you look on each of the faces, there's only two colors. There's the color of the face, which it's on, and there's the color of the opposite face. So red and orange, yellow and white, and blue and green. So if you haven't guessed yet, this puzzle is an 180 degree cube. The original 180 degree cube was made by uh, that guy right there. And then later, um, Oscar Van Deventer made, uh, he made, he asked for permission, he made a version of it for him uh, as well. But uh, my version is unique because unlike their ones where uh, I guess I can show a picture of you. A <laughs> picture of you. I guess I can show you a picture of it. Uh, their ones had outer layers which weren't uh, proportional, so the faces didn't look like a regular Rubik's Cube. It looks like a, a, a skewed Rubik's Cube or something like that. Um, but I managed to uh, make it so everything is in the inside of the cube rather than being on the outside of the cube. In the spirit of Oscar's videos, I have a question for you guys. My question for you, um, is how many unique pieces does this puzzle have? I'll give you a hint for that question. On this puzzle, all the pieces which can exchange uh, places look exactly the same. If a piece can exchange places with another piece through only 180 degree turns, then uh, the pieces, uh, they won't be unique pieces. So if, uh, if you can figure that, that question out, you can leave your answer in the comments below and I, I may be able to think of a prize or something that I can give out to the person who gets it first. Anyhow, um, so yeah, thank, thank you for watching.